Strawberry milk. It is episode number 47, baby! Hello! Wow, hello! hello. Uh, we've been, so been gone for three weeks. Three weeks? Why? What were Why, you doing uh? for three weeks? I uh, don't know. Eat uh, Mandarin oranges, oranges, you know. Yeah, yeah. Visit friends, visit relatives, take ampau. Oh, I'm drinking special water from this place. Ah, yeah, this is a This is uh, what mini mart uh, they call it. Mm. Hey, I want to drink so. Why? Like orange juice. Beautiful. Mm. Alright, so this uh, is the Cyborg Edition. Uh, we got lots of Cyborg news to turn you into the next Jedi as well. And also we are going to review a gadget that goes into the water and will come out safely. Oh, next. First story that will turn you into Cyborg is, uh, you know passwords nowadays, everyone seems to be remembering also name no many passwords, it's like uh, unbelievable. And then Twitter gets hacked, like, you gotta change the password. Uh, uh, you know, so someone's come out this thing called the My ID Key. MyIDKey.com, you go to this website, you can see on the screen right now, it's this little USB thumb drive. Okay. Okay, it's got a little screen, uh -huh. you can put in your password and all that inside. Okay. But what's really cool is that it can use your voice and your thumbprint to open and access uh, information about your account. For instance, uh, for instance, you save Gmail information. Okay. You just put your thumb there and say Gmail. Gmail. Oh, Gmail will appear. Uh, then? Then the password will show up, then you just type in it. Uh. You still have to type the password? Uh? Yeah, of course! Then what's the point? The point is you save password for you. And if you ever lose this gadget, you can actually go to the cloud and say delete your wipe remotely. Fuck! Next. My next news is better. Okay, what's yours? It's called the steel case gesture chair. Oh, wow. Alright. So basically, it's a chair. It's a chair? Uh, for you to sit. Okay, sure. Uh, after you, you sit, sit right, yeah. you can adjust the chair according to your posture, uh, uh, the posture that you're comfortable with, with your uh, gadgets. So, you know some people, they read their tablets like that. Oh. Some they read like that. Oh. Right. So the chair can actually match Oh. The, 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 post, the posture based it's, on it, how you read your doesn't gadgets. work for me because I read my gadget like that. <laughs> so I hey, actually got a bit of video. Okay. Yeah, I'll show you guys what I watch now. Caused us to fundamentally rethink how we do a chair. We looked at these new postures in the workplace and asked, what if we could design a chair that encourages motion rather than forcing the body to hold a pose that supports your arms while texting, that cradles your back while you're reclining and scrolling, that draws you closer to your work so that you don't need to hunch over to see the screen. Another one that's pretty cool is a gadget I'm so proud to say I actually pre-ordered, okay? Uh, what's this? this is by uh, Leap Motion. Leap Motion. They're creating a gadget which is so small. You're gonna show you're gonna see it on the screen right now. It's this small. Mm. And what happens is uh, you can wave your fingers over it and your arms over it, and you can use this gadget to control your screen. Uh, it could be a computer screen, it could be your gaming console. So oh, oh my god. You mean if we have this thing we can play food ninja like that? Quick. Ah, oh. so it's a little bit like Kinect, you know, Microsoft's Kinect. Uh, yes, yes. But you don't use Kinect, you use this little gadget and you put it in front of your computer and you hook it up and everything will work out. How wow. much? Uh? It is only 79 US dollars right now. 79 US dollars, that's about 300 ringgit. Free shipping. Oh, okay, well. Next. This is probably the biggest project by Google after I am so, so many years. I'm so excited right, about it's it. It's called Google Glass. Basically, yes. it's a, it's a, it's, it's not actually a glasses. It's mm -hmm. not actually spectacles. Yeah, it's, it's like actually, a frame. It's a, it's a metal thing device that you can wear on your head mm -hmm. and it's here. Right. So, uh, it has a camera in front and a screen at the back. Right. Right, so you can actually read the, whatever your email, your SMS and everything on the screen and you can use it to take picture, you can use it for navigation, you can use it to take videos and all you need to do is just tell the glass to do something like this. Google. Okay, glass. Wow. Take a picture. Fuck. Ching, ching, ching. Ching. Nah, Lovely. Ching. Yeah. We promise you we'll be one of the first to get it. You ready? Right there. Okay, glass. Take a picture. Next one is this one. We're gonna take you to a uh, Yoda. It's not really Yoda. It's more like those gestures, like you know. Ah, another you, gesture. It's another gesture thing, but this time you can go like that. Whoa! Got some one. Got some effect. You can like turn it on, and then you go wow like that. <laughs> uh, wow like that. So essentially, using uh, your uh, this gadget is like a little band that you hook it up on your arm. Okay. And it detects your muscle movement. So when you do your finger movements like that, your muscles inside move. Correct. And these muscles will then send signals through the band to your gadget. So if you're trying to fly a helicopter, for instance, you just uh, do. This, what? And then the this, go up. it just go up and fly. And then all that. So cool! I, I know, love right? it, and it's uh, actually for sale right now. Really? Uh, it's called the Ma Get Mayo device How for much? 149 US dollars. Hey, then you want nicer, like cheaper? I know, right? Oh. I like this. Yeah. 
another future device. Yeah. All right, the guys at MIT, they are working on this thing called world's first 4D printer. Oh, this is the one where you put in the water and come out again. La. No, la, that's oh. the other one. Oh. Uh, that's a gadget review. Oh. Uh, yes. So basically, right, actually, have you heard of 3D printing? Yeah. So, something that's not there, you take a picture and print, a, say for example, a hammer if you want. Uh, a real the thing, hammer. The thing will actually print the whole object out, right? Yeah, yeah. So this is 4D printing, it's even more chunky. How? Uh? It will print out a strand of, uh, you know, uh, a, a strings, la, a okay. lot of strings, right. that you can actually mold it to become something. So once you mold it, right, you become like that. You cannot move really. But, if you put it inside water, uh -huh. you can bend it and mold it again and it will become another thing, another object. And that's 4D? That's 4D, that 4D la. That's not 4D. 4D means you 4D can... 4D is when this object comes and touch you. No, that's or, 4D. Or you can smell the thing. Or you smell the thing, or you touch the object and you go like, So oh, basically, okay. they shouldn't uh. call it 4D la. They should call it 6D. Uh. So for gadget review this week, we have the upcoming Sony Xperia Z. Uh, according to them, this is actually the best of Sony put into one device. Mm -hmm. So uh, it has a 5 inch screen, very very high res because it's probably the first uh, phone with 1080p resolution. Mm -hmm. So it's 1080p here. That's nice. Yes, and uh, it's very thin. Wow. Wow. And this thing is waterproof, right? Yes, and it's full glass as you can see and it has a Ooh. 13 megapixel camera here. And uh, everything is sealed, you see. The, the headphone jack is sealed, the SIM card slot is sealed, the charger port is sealed, and uh, the only button you can see here is actually the volume toggle and also the power button. Right. Yes. And uh, let's take a look at the interface. It's basically just Android Jelly Bean as usual, and uh, some nice widgets by Sony as oh, usual. Oh, that's nice. Yes, and uh, the weather, which does not work because you don't have internet connection. And uh, this is the app drawer. What about the timescape? Is it still there? Uh, I actually hide it already. Oh, okay. I don't really like timescape. But they do have widget. timescape. Yes. And another feature that I like is actually this. You can actually sort the icons based on your own order, as oh. well most use and recently installed. That's nice. Yes, and uh, one thing I don't like is when we want to add a widget, the widgets are all here. I can okay. only see four widgets in one screen, so I need to scroll and scroll and scroll and scroll and yeah, scroll. Yeah, they should have reduced this. Yes, or just put full screen widget, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So uh, apart from that, the camera is really, really good. It's sharp. Let me see. Uh, here it is. As you can see, oh, we are taking a picture auntie? of this auntie. Dodo, la, let's take a picture. All right. all right. It has this superior auto feature, which is actually an auto mode. Mm -hmm. Uh, it will basically detect what you are pointing at and it will change to the particular mode. That's Apart nice. from that, we have also a scene modes, we have fun camera, we have burst shot, we have panorama, sweet panorama as usual like all the other Sony Cybershot cameras. Yep. And uh, it has another feature called HDR video. Wow. So basically, if you're taking an object and then behind the object is very bright sunlight, yeah. you can still see the person's face. It will and automatically compensate. La. Yes, and the background will not be super bright. You can still see the objects in the background as well. Wow. So uh, we don't have the price for this yet because it's not even launched. Uh, it will be launched soon. I think it's next week uh, or current or this week uh, if you're watching it. Next week. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> so, so this is the Sony Xperia Z. Let's pour some water on it now. Wow, some more, some more, some more, some more. Wow, oh no. Wow, that's just incredible. Washing the floor. So that's the end of episode 47. Thank you so much for joining us, and uh, we hope you can now turn into a cyborg because of the ideas we gave you. Uh. And also all the gadgets that you can buy in the future. All the links at the bottom, you can click on there, uh, mm. click on it, and then you can uh, enjoy. Uh, okay, uh, bye. Uh. Have a nice day.